Hello friends, Tony here, welcome. In this video I'm going to talk about uh, Vue.js. When I start to learn uh, front-end uh, frameworks, I made a search about uh, which one is better, Vue.js, React or uh, Angular, and I start learning the Vue.js. Vue.js is again, is a very uh, lightweight, you can, it's easy to learn and so on, but uh, I saw that uh, is not uh, as popular as was before. I think the Vue.js is going down nowadays. And for that I have opened here some tabs and see some charts for Vue.js. First here I have opened the, and I'm going to zoom it for you, is the survey from Stack Overflow in 2020. And here we can see Vue.js is a uh, 17% React is 35, okay, Angular is 25, good. We can scroll down, but I'm going to leave it right now like this and see from uh, 2020, which is 17% to 21. So 21, here we are, Web Frameworks, and we can see on the 2020 was 70%, uh, on the 21 is 80 almost 19 percent so let's see from 17 to 19 okay let's see now the 2022 here we are in the 2022 and web frameworks and we can see UJS is again it's okay it's remaining almost 19 uh, percent so from 2021 is dropped a uh, little big. Now from 2022 to 2023 I'm going to see web frameworks also here is huge drop. So we start on 2020 with 17%. 21 18 or almost 19% then almost 19 then on 2023 16% okay let's see now the 2024 what we have 2024 we have a drop again which is 15 percent and yeah we had vue.js version 3 and we don't have any updates so vue.js version 4 for example uh new improvements we had that composition api which was great uh, which is great but we, uh, I think developers needs developers needs to have some changes updates uh, to improve some things VGS is great but I think it can do better for that we can see that react remaining at top here but uh, what I want to show you is to see the svelte we have 6.5 percent here on the 2023, 6.6. .6. On uh, 2022, Svelte is 4. So Svelte is taking some points. Also, I open here the state of JS for the 2023 because it's not ready the 2024. And here we can see that the usage of React, Vue, Angular, and so on. Let's start with React, which is raising, as you can see. It's going to, from 26, uh, from 2016 to be 50 per 52%. Now, on the 2023, we have React uh, to go 84%. For Vue.js, also Vue.js is raising but on 2021, we can see Vue.js was 51%, uh, then dropped 48%, then again up the, let's see, 50%. But if we see in the 24, I think maybe it's going to drop again. Uh, yeah, Alpine.js is 77%, but Svelte 
yeah he's going to take point again here as we can see good let's see uh, interest in here and on react yeah it's dropping because i think uh, react uh, almost every developer uh, use react and know have heard about react but for vue.js again yeah it's okay has been dropped and i think it's okay the interest for svelte almost uh, the same okay and for the positivity we can see react is okay vue.js yeah then let's see here uh, frameworks experience and sentiment we can see here react 65 percent used it and has positive 20 negative uh, for vue.js 38 percent used it and had a positive sentiment 12 percent negative and for svelte you can see 22 percent used and has positive and had a positive but only four percent had a negative and here heard and had a positive is 48 percent a huge number okay now also i have opened here the trends from google and we have vue.js search term react.js and svelte and here we can see i'm going to zoom it out also here worldwide past five years programming i have chosen as a category and also we have here youtube search on youtube you can see react is dominating also here vue.js with the svelte from 2019 vue.js is up but then on the 2023 we have here more searches for svelte now what if i add uh, let's say uh, Vue.js has a topic okay but if I search for react and react computer program we can see that uh, react is far away okay also we can scroll down so for example interest for Vue.js or we can say interest for uh, Vue.js as a topic uh, Cambodia, Russia, South Korea, Germany and so on then uh, Vue.js related queries Svelte, Vue.js composition, API, Nux and Vue.js 3 Okay friends that's it all about what I wanted to show you in uh, this video the Vue.js where it was and where it's going and also I had the comments on YouTube to make videos with Laravel and Vue.js which uh, I'm going to create such a videos but just to see that Vue.js uh, is no longer I think the most loved uh, front-end framework now if you like such a videos friends don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and uh, see you in the next video all the best